Hi guys, welcome to today's video. I'm going to be doing what's in my makeup bag because I've got a lot of stuff in my makeup bag. Everyone has different things. So yeah, I'm going to be doing what's in mine and what I, and what junk I carry about with me basically. So let's move on to face first. I've got the Body Shop Extra, Extra Virgin, Virgin Minerals Foundation. Oh god, that's a full. <laughs> so the the Body Shop Extra Virgin Minerals Powder Foundation. Okay, I got the right. Let's go, let's go. And this is in Golden Ivory. This is quite a pale shade, but it fits me perfectly. And this is this is a loose powder foundation. So trust me. Look, if you can see that in the. Yeah, it's it's loose stuff. Not perfect for buses, but it fits me perfectly. And to put this on, I've got the Body Shop Face and Body Brush. Now, this ain't cheap, I won't lie, but it works. And also, this it's a it's good for the money, because it's better than buying a MAC brush. So, next I've got the Body Shop All-in-One Concealer. Now, this replaced the Body Shop, their, all, their moisturising concealer, and I've got this in 03. I love this concealer, it hides my bags perfectly. <laughs> okay, what else is in here? Jesus Christ. And onto, now moisturizers. I forgot to do that first, but I'll just do it now. I've got the Ren Clear, the Ren Vitamin Roll Daily Supplement Moisturizing Cream. Now this is a little tester tube. But I use this daily and I use it like there, 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 there and there. Now this just gives and also on my top lip. Now this just makes my skin not as dry. I don't put it all over my face otherwise I'd be a spotty mess. And as also and I've also got the Balance Me Tinted Wonder Eye Cream. This is with light reflecting particles for all skin types, 99% natural, perfect for sensitive skin. I've not got sensitive skin, but if you have, then you should try that out. Now, next we've got like all sorts of brushes. Now this is the, basically this is from the Imbram and Poundland. Now this is an eyeshadow brush. I like this brush, it's, it is really good for a pound. And now don't use it for your crease, otherwise you'll, you'll get a bit scratchy, but as an eyeshadow brush, it's soft patting on the color. Next I've got, I don't know what this is, but it's like, it's like a really soft eyeshadow brush that's quite thick. It's like that thick, but I use this for blending my crease. If I ever mess up my makeup. And now, sometimes I feel like contouring. So I have the Poundland Angled Blush Brush. And with the, oh by the way, with this I use my Sunkiss Bronzing Pearls. I have, I've had these forever. In first year I used to put them all over my face. I don't know why, but it seemed to make me look more tan. So that's a good idea. And I've got this Bud Shop eyeshadow brush. It's just like, just like a flat eyeshadow brush. Nothing to it. And I've got a tangled brush. Oh Jesus Christ, that's minging cold. Let me know if you've got a minging cold at the moment. I, it's driving me mental. And I've got like an angled brush. I don't fill in my eyebrows, but just in case I ever need it, you never know what can happen in a day. I've got like a soft brush for smoking out my lash line, my under, un, like, so you can go like that and then smoke it. Now, and I've got like this weird little brush for blending out my contour if it fails. Also, that's really old. I don't know where it's from, but hey, it works. Now, another thing from the Imbram and Pound. 
This is the Rimmel Vinyl Gloss in Pin Up. And I've got the Barbara Daly Velvet Blush in Caramel. I sometimes use this like an eyeshadow, as well as in the crease. It's really good actually, for natural makeup days, which rarely come, but hey. Sometimes it, sometimes if you want to look natural, you need a look a tint. So I've got the Body Shop Chicken Lip Stain in Dusty Rose. Now, you'll notice I've not got proper eyeshadows. That serves as my eyeshadow. I don't know why, but it works for me. And also, this Body Shop Pomegranate Born Lippy Stick Thingabob. And then I've got this lip liner. It's like a neutrally pink colour. Again, I don't know what this is. I got the... No. Had it forever. Don't know. As you can tell, I've got a lot of makeup. I don't know what it is. I just use it. Because let's face it, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go out and buy all new stuff just so I know what it is. Oh my god, this is amazing. Now I've got and for perfume, I've got a really nice one. I love this stuff to bits, you guys, honestly. It is a flaming miracle. So I've got the Body Shop Atlas Mountain Rose Perfume. This is the good stuff. You know, make it back on. I'll find it. Right. So I have this and then eyeliner. I've got it's the Miss Beauty retractable eye pencil in black. It doesn't say it's retractable, but it is. I've lost the lid for it, but who the hell is gonna buy a new one just to grab a lid? Let's face it. And then I've got the no, not the shop. I've got the Poundland Call Me Beautiful eye pencil in black and this is by Makeup Gallery. Congratulations to Poundland, your names on your products are amazing. How do you figure out all these amazing names? Like, I don't know. So I've got that and then that's about it. Oh, by the way, I carry, in my makeup bag, I carry about just in case I mess up. You never know when you're going to mess up and like a raccoon. Because doing eyeliner in the waterline ain't pretty if you're doing it on a bus. That's why I have this. The, the Nivea Daily Essentials Extra Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. Sens for a sensitive eye area, gently removes mascara and makeup for well cured eyelashes. I don't know if all those claims are true, but I use it. And then this stuff is quite expensive. But this is what I use to take off my eye makeup a lot of the time. So yeah, that's what's in my makeup bag. Oh, and by the way, I've got this really pretty clean makeup bag. It's got like flowers and inside it's all, it's all pink. I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day.